This is a hotly debated topic and people have very strong opinions. I think you have to look at the makeup of the trial to uh, carefully evaluate and we're all guilty of cross-trial comparisons and certainly those that look at the bottom line of the study might say that Fulfirinox has the edge if one looks at median survival which was approaching 11 and a half months compared to eight and a half months, uh, the latter in the gemcitabine and apaclitaxel phase three. But we do know that uh, performance status, age, and where patients are recruited to studies have big impacts on outcome. And uh, it's, you know, it, it is an important question to be able to answer. I'm not sure that it's necessarily worthy of all the resources and not just financial, but patients and time and family contributions to, to conduct a study like that. There are perhaps more important areas where, where efforts uh, may be better focused. Um, but I think the way I would think about it is that choices are good and we now have the luxury of treatment options for patients with untreated pancreas cancer.